almost there. Fucking find Mr. the crown. This part of this, I, uh, he, he must have like a fucking chair or a throne. I want to see what the kind of chair he has. Was it better than mine? Better than my father's? What's this? Why the fuck are you getting this? I should have potion, not this shit. Potion? There we go. He's here. I can feel him. <laughs> Finally, I will take your power, you son of a bitch. The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Butcher. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep. They roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice born of the pain and suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall, not as a puppet, but as a man. Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, man lost sight of the gift's true meaning, stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens, and they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open, and so did I spread my arms to the ether, and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Proven, 
The Lord charged me thus. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering, shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? <clears throat> what you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead. <laughs> Very well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you. But the weakness of yours. Read back, you saw your bitch. Prove it. Where's this bitch taller than me? Holy fuck. You shall know it. notion of hope when there is none.
so it ends. <laughs> Don't tell me you are tired, Mythos! Your stubborn defiance has stirred my long becalmed heart, filling it with a joy that I have not known for generations! I had thought the tantalizing kiss of self-indulgence a dream part of out of reach. But now that its sweet ruin causes thou my veins, I shall not be quick to relinquish it. So may your work be thus that I might revel in it! My god! Fuck! Not this move! Not this shit! Fuck. 
fucking bitch. We have sought my crown, Mythos. But nothing could rest it from my head. I who stand victorious, my will that prevailed. Your will? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield. To fucking get his power! Fuck! I have to fucking chase after him now. Strive for a new world. Strive to win your master's approval. I... You were 
was shown a fantasy, and you chose to believe it. But you were wrong. There is no world but the one we live in. And that world... That world is worth saving, even if it means killing a god. Crystals have fulfilled theirs. Come, Clive Rossfield. Take what is rightfully yours. Become one with God. No. It's not yours yet. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There all shall end and begin again. 